Καλησπέρα σας. Ε, <coughs> dear Professor Yakovu, dear Dr. Florenzos, dear students, good evening. I welcome you all to the tonight's lecture of, of Professor Jaromir Kovarnik from the Hradec Kralove University at Bohemia of the Czech Republic. Professor Kovarnik came on Monday to Cyprus. It is uh, his first time being in the Eastern Mediterranean, and he is very excited, <coughs> in particular, about the material culture of the, earlier, uh, the earliest prehistory of Cyprus. This week, he is with us <coughs> within the framework of the Erasmus Exchange program that gives the opportunity not only to students to study for one or two semesters at another European university, but also to professors to teach courses and seminars related <coughs> to their expertise. On Tuesday, he offered a highly interesting uh, course about the Moravian East Austrian group of the painted pottery culture in the Middle Danube. That means uh, about fifth and fourth millennia <coughs> millennium cultures of Central Europe. Professor Kovarnik has studied archaeology and history at the philosophical faculty of the Masaryk University in Brno, in Moravia, from which he has also received his PhD. He has served for 26 years at the South Moravian Museum, firstly as an archaeological officer and then as the museum's director. In 1998 to 2003, he has taught as an associate professor at the Institute of Archaeology and Museology of the Philosophical Faculty of the Marasek University in Brno. Since 2008, he is professor at the Department of Archaeology of the University of Hradec Kralove in Bohemia. His research interests focus in the Neolithic and Neolithic periods, the Moravian East <coughs> sorry, Austrian group of the painted pottery culture, <coughs> on the rondels of the late Neolithic, and uh, on aerial archaeology. Aerial archaeology depicts an important method of landscape archaeology, and Professor Kovarnik is a big and uh, well-known expert, as he has introduced and he is applying aerial archaeology in uh, um, Central European countries since 1982. He is a fanatic field archaeologist and director of many excavations since 1978. He has published or co-edited several books and articles in Czech, German, and English about aspects of the Neolithic and the Enneolithic, that means the Calcolithic in Europe, as well as about methods and applications in aerial archaeology. In the tonight's lecture, he will give us a taste of his expertise by presenting monumental circular enclosures, so-called rondels, of the late Neolithic in the Czech Republic. Professor Kovanik. Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, Rondels, also yeah. also now as archaeological features surrounding by circle ditches and enclosures or hinges in English, Kreisgraden Anlagen in German are monumental circle structures that were in late Neolithic built up across Central Europe. There is uh, uh, Czech Republic, and uh, the Czech Republic are two parts. One is here, east part, it is Moravia, yeah, with uh, metropolis Brno, and the west part is Bohemia with our capital Prague and I live with my family in this town in Znojmo. Uh, it is uh, uh, about 80 kilometers uh, north of Vienna, of uh, Austria. Rondals consist of one, two, three, or rarely four, five, or six circle ditches, which as typical V-shape profile broken by one, two, 
for the most frequently or more entrances into the inner space frequent, uh, frequently delimited by one uh, intersequences development as a younger phenomenon. Quenstedt uh, in central Germany, Zhilkovce in uh, southwest Slovakia, and the Dolní Beškovice, central Bohemia. The number of rondels has grown due to the use of aerial archaeological prospection. We supplement our research with uh, geophysical methods, especially magnetometric measurements. Spreading. It is a typology, typology of rondels. And rondels were typical large-scale structures classified into small, middle, and large sized according to diameter of ditches ranging from 30 meters to uh, 210 meters, rarely also 450 or 550 meters uh, for Central European late Neolithic uh, cultures. For the Eclot group in Romania, the Polgar Chesagalum group in East Hungary, the Langeal culture in West Hungary, so called Transdanubia. and Southwest Slovakia for the Moravian East Austrian group in East Austria and in South Moravia. Yeah. And, uh, uh, the, um, and for Stroket pottery culture in Bohemia for the West part of Czech Republic And Saxony, Saxony Anhalt, it is central Germany for the Oberlauterbach group in all over Bavaria. And Grossgarta group in central Franconia. As the southeast part of Germany and for the Russian culture in North Rhine Westphalia in um, West Germany here. In the fourth and third millennia BC, similar circular uh, structure were built up also in other parts of Europe, in Spain, in France, Great Britain, or in Denmark. Rondels represented the most probably communal areas for social, religion, and ritual activities, as ditches and entrances show little signs of uh, defensive features. Rondals in Moravia and uh, Bohemia. Soils suitable for uh, corn growing were uh, hospitable conditions for the Neolithic farmers to settle. The land along the terrace edge was an ideal environment for passage across the old country. The land formed a framework for the described events passing across the country, sharing activities, hunting and fishing, fruit picking since the Neolithic also establishing fields and uh, grazing land for cattle farming in the vicinity. The land played an important role as both an active element and a consequent product of social and cultural development. In the Czech Republic, uh, 51 or more Rondels had been discovered, 39 in Bohemia and 12 in Moravia, majority of uh, them according to positive crop marks instead of cereals or as soil marks on arable land by means of er er ecological remote sensing and some uh, because of re rescue excavations.
now Rondels in Moravia. The occurrence of Rondels in Moravia corresponds with the oikumene of the settlement from the oldest stage of the Moravian East Austrian group, MOG, uh, 1A phase of the painted pottery culture. Here is Lendial culture in uh, Transdanubia, in Hungary, West Hungary, and Southwest Slovakia. Yes, and not in this part is old phase uh, or, or stage of uh, Moravian, uh, pottery culture, Moravian pottery culture. It is uh, the territory of uh, South and Southwest Moravia from today's state border with Austria, Lower Austria in the south, the surrounding uh, of Brno, which is the metropolis of Moravia. To date, we have now at least 12 rondels. From south and southwest Moravia. It is a difference compared to the territory of neighboring Lower Austria, where 40 rondels were found. For uh, these uh, rondels are uh, in this region, and in this region we name Weinviertel, um, um, Lower Austria, and Weinviertel, there is Waldviertel. It is uh, natural because South Moravia is already the northern edge, edge of the Middle Danube region. There is not uh, so many occurrence of settlements from the oldest MOG stage. Histogram. Yes. And a list of rondels from Moravia. Interestingly, we did not find uh, tribal rondels in south uh, and southwest Moravia as in Lower Austria. There are seven and probably more simple and five double rondels. Rondels are situated again on suitable gentle slopes or on plateau with less in spring areas. These are the simple rondels of Těšetice. Němčičky, uh, Běhařovice, There is crop marks, yes. Uh, magnetometric measurements, Vedrovice, small excavation. There are long houses, uh, but uh, uh, from uh, uh, linear pottery culture, this. It is a superposition. Nové Branice, Brno Country District and Trashovice, District Vyškov, which is situated to the north. They also include double rondels such as Mas Mašovice and Křepice z Neumo district and double rondel near Mohelno. Třebič district in South West Moravia. The last two double rondels, Bulhary and Milovice, were situated differently on the right terrace of the river Die, German Taya, in the lower stream. We also found in South Moravia a large triple, enclo uh, the triple enclosure of the circle ground plan near Kiev Bohuslavice, 
hydronium discrete dated to the MOG 1A phase and a large double enclosure. Here, Bohuslavice. And uh, a large uh, double enclosure of an overall uh, grow ground plan of Casarnas pneumodistic that may be somewhat younger, probably from the MOG1B phase. There are two ditches, and palisades is here. Among these find findings, we can also mention a uh, find of a rondel near Borkovany, Czesław district. Soil marks. The discovery of a circle ditch, maybe rondel, with four entrances in the center of Moravia at Tuchapi, Olomouc dist dist district, could prove it inclusion in another culture, namely the Stocket Pottery Culture SBK for a subface. There. In central Moravia, there were no settlements of the Moravian East Austrian group, MOG 1A phase. Measurement of geophysic. And now rondels in Bohemia. Uh, in Bohemia, uh, we found about uh, uh, 35 and now uh, 39 rondels. And uh, it is very interesting that in Eastern Bohemia. Here I am working, yes, is uh, a big uh, uh, concentration of these uh, objects. In Eastern Bohemia, close to the local metropolis Hradec Králové, this is list of Bohemia, of Rondas, and it is map of region between town Hradec Králové and, and Jaroměř. In eastern Bohemia, close the local metropolis Hradec Králové, 11 rondels were discovered so far, and nine of them are located on Elbe River, Labe in Czech, terraces on the line 15 kilometers long between towns Jaroměř and Hradec Králové on the important prehistoric trackways on the right bank of the Elbe River. Location. As far as the rondel accumulation at the edge of the Elbe right terrace as a possibility in the Indic indicator is uh, concerned the triple rondel with con uh, connected ditches at Jaromne Semonice, Nacho district, was situated near the confluence of the Elbe and its tributaries with uh, Upa uh, and Metuje. The simple rondels at the urban dis uh, district Smirice Holohlavy in proximity to the confluence of the stream Jordan to Elbe, the double rondel with connected ditches Lochenice 1 near the confluences the river Trotina and Lochenice 2, At the confluence of the Elbe River and the stream Olšovka and Trotina, 
the uh, triple rondel with the middle ditch and drawn inverse plotiště nad laben tu. It is inner ditch and this middle outer and there is entrance. As well as the double rondel at Kukleni. Hradec Králové district at the confluence of the Elbe and the Brook Melonka and in partial the river Orlice. According to our information, this is the area with the highest density of uh, stroked pottery culture rondels in Europe. The rondel Plotiště nad Labem II was discovered according to positive crop marks on thermograph aerial photographs in stands of cereals. As this tribal rondel was preserved only from one half and there has been an expansion of the village uh, Plotiště, the preserved part of the rondel has been highly engendered by new building activities. We therefore uh, decided to excavate it part of the rondel to obtain information about its uh, construction and ancient human activities in the area of uh, the rondel and in uh, its close in neighborhood. There is entrance, one ditch, second and third. Our students, and it is inner ditch with this profile, web profile. It is a reconstruction. with post hole here. It is inner ditch here. Yes. And it is a middle ditch. Situation inner ditch and middle ditch with uh, this uh, wink like corridors and there is entrance to inner It is stroked pottery. And the, the discoveries of rondels of the right terrace of the Elbe is a new phenomenon. According to early opinion, the occurrence of rondels had been assumed in the spring areas. The location of rondels on the edge of the terrace was of strategic importance. It allowed inter alia keeping a good track not only of the movement of animals, but also people across the broad area of the Elbe Valley, including the confluences and uh, crossways of roads passing by. Among these discoveries, we add further finds of the circle enclosure and the uh, Hlum, Hradec Králové district, in the spring area of the brooks Orshovka and Melonka, which are the right bank tributaries of Elbe or the double rondel at the uh, municipality of Třebovětice. In forest. Teaching district in the spring area of the river Trotina. Undoubtedly, they are remains of important higher old, uh, order settlement uh, at the Elbe confluences which seem to have played a role of significant centers of agriculture, social, ritual, life, 
of uh, late Neolithic farmers of the uh, subface SBH um, for A. We have found that a similar situation was, for instance, near the confluence of the rivers Mje, Radbuza, Uhlava, Uslava in Pilsen Basin, Pilsen Beer, <laughs> Pilsen Basin in uh, West Bohemia. A double and uh, simple rondel was found at the right terrace of the Mje, about 1,400 uh, uh, meters away in a settlement of the subface uh, SBK for a Vokhov Plzeň North District. An analogical location was also at a double rondel of the face MOGA 1A at the uh, the right terrace of the Die near the confluences with uh, the river Štinkovka in Milovice in southern Moravia. During our research, we increased the number of rondels found on the right hand terrace of uh, Albe. Another finding of the aerial archaeology and magnetometry is that the triple rondels at uh, Jaromir Semonice and in Plotiště nad Labem again have new. Uh, subtypes of ground plants. On the other hand, the double rondel in Lochenice 2 belongs to the types of rondels with joint ditches, type Lochenice Künzing Unterberg from uh, Lower Austria, as well as the rondel at Lochenice 1. Founding of the rondels on the edge of the right terrace of the river Elbe proves that the settlements and fields of the subface SBK for A were situated in the direction west, north, and south of the rondels. From these rondels was a very good outlook, both in the wall, uh, valley of uh, the river Elbe and also the Sanarai, as well as the peaks of the Krkonoše mountains and Orlické hory Eagle Mountains. We found uh, that the Elbe River played a very important role in the late Neolithic period, not only in East Bohemia. Numerous settlements of the SBK for A phase are documented along uh, its flow. What is very interesting is that, um, again, in place of confluences, there are other rondels of the SBK for A subphase. In total, we noticed there are uh, 19 rondels. The four rondels are concentrated and confluences tributaries Dobravka, Kleinarka, Polepka, and Kolin. It is a concentration uh, near of Hradec Králové, yes? And it is in Kolin, um, near the town Poděbrady tributary Cidlina, then Dolní Peškovice a Želízy, tributaries Vltava, German Moldau and Libiechovka near Prague, yes, confluences are here, in central Bohemia. The rondel at Chinice is situated at the confluence of the Elbe and Ohře, German Eger, Yes, and uh, the last double rondel was di discovered during the reconstruction of uh, the medieval town center of Ustí nad Labem at the confluence of Elbe and the Bielina River in northern Bohemia. Uh, there uh, is Saxony, German. Reconstruction, one of uh, one rondel of uh, Colleen, the second, Jalizi, another double rondel near Benátky, Mladá Poleslav district, is located on the terrace of the river Jizera and a simple rondel, Skupice. Uh, 
Cloney district with three palisades. On the terrace of the river Ohře, a simple rondel Strashkov near uh, Litoměřice district is situated between the rivers Elbe, Vltava and Ohře. Several settlements of the SBK 4A sub uh, subface uh, with the rondels also know from the territory of the capital uh, Prague, Prague Rosinje, for example. It is a typical profile of rondels. In the spring area, there are a double and triple rondel at Bilani, Kutná Hora district in central Bohemia. One outer enclosure, very large and triple rondel here. Dating. Another significant finding in the result of uh, radiocarbon dating of the rondel at Plotiště nad Labentu, for example, 5,795, uh, it means uh, for uh, 1723 to 4547 uh, BC or uh, 5745 uh, BP. It means uh, 4690 to 4500 BC calibrated date. The oldest rondel were, con were constructed in uh, uh, Hungary, in South Hungary, at uh, Semei, 4950 to 4790 BC, then She Malamidule and Sorma Sterek Feldek. These are therefore oldest rondels in Central Europe. These dates are comparable to the date for 1950 to 4780 BC from the ditch of the enclosure, but not of the rondel of the face um, Stroket Pottery uh, Culture 3, Kolin Stjaralka. Rondels of the uh, stage MOG 1. An important date uh, for 1800. Uh, to 4590 BC come from the pointed base of the rondel ditch in Steinabrunn in um, Lower Austria. And uh, from the younger Bavarian group of Stroket pottery culture from the rondel Kinzing Untenberg, we now date from the time of use 4840 to uh, 4000. Uh, 780 BC and from the termination horizon for 1740 to uh, uh, 4590 BC. We come to a partial con conclusion that the youngest date uh, for 1741 from the base of the inner ditch of the Rondel from the younger Bavarian group uh, in Kinzing Unterberg is very close to the youngest date of the layer from uh, the base of the inner ditch of the rondel near Protiště nad Labem II. Building of a rondel in uh, Stefanspöching und Weit von Münich uh, was dated between 4700 to 4650 and its end in the years 4605. The rondel with six oriented entrances of the Grossgarta uh, group, it is uh, Germany, Franconia, from Ipesheim, was built 4800 and uh, 4700 BC. 
horizon with rondels. Rondels uh, are uh, found in different archaeological cultures, which, however, created a certain time horizon in the early period of the late Neolithic. We also investigate the remarkable archaeological found of parts or even wall painted vessel of the Moravian East Austrian group of the painted pottery culture in settlements with rondels of the stroked pottery culture in eastern and central Bohemia in connection with the occurrence of a large concentration of rondels in eastern Bohemia, Hradec Králové, Náchod and Jičín district. Fragments on vessels of MOG 1A were found for example in the settlement of Předměřice nad Lamem. Uh, other beaker was also found in the ditch of the Rondel Lochenice 1, Hradec Králové district. Undoubtedly, it is a case of imported painted vessels that were brought from the territory of Central Danube, Lower Austria and South Moravia. These important finds make us, us believe that uh, the people who brought them might have participated in the building of uh, rondels in another archaeological culture. They might have brought know-how of rondels and help with the construction. They might, might also have uh, attended uh, certain ceremonies in these uh, circular uh, sites. They might have been present at the initiation of the new built rondel, or they might have been ceremonially welcomed as significant visitors from a relatively distant region, etc. Also, brides may have been invited from neighboring cultures and so on. In these very valuable finds, we therefore derive certain cultural uh, interaction between rondel builders a bus within the MOG1A phase from Middle Danube and the SBK4A uh, subface in Bohemia. Banks. We learn an important fact that the rondels had <coughs> banks. We de documented presence of the banks of the outside of the ditches in Trebavietice, Yichin district with the remains of the wooden construction which is unique throughout uh, Central Europe. Also, an important contribution <coughs> is the provided evidence of the destruction of the outer bank in the layer number two in the inner ditch uh, of the triple rondel at uh, Plotištěn nad Labem II, Hradec Králové district. The bank discovery helped deepen the uh, study of rondel typology. And there are ditch, bank, ditch, and bank. It is uh, very, very, very nice found. The existence of bank significantly influenced the formative processes in rondel ditches. If the banks had been in the outside of the ditches, banks would have caused increased erosion to occur only from the inside of the rondel. However, if the rondels had an inner single or multiple palisade, the erosion would also have been complicated from the inner surface until the palisade pressure. We are believed that the function of the rondels was mainly bound uh, to its inner space as a catering place, but also to the massive ditches, banks and palisades as important defining uh, elements and uh, integral components that also contained a great deal of energy. Undoubtedly, his gates played an important role. Also important was his location in the landscape. In our opinion, building a bank with a diameter smaller than uh, that of its own ditch along the inner edge 
of the inner ditch of uh, multiple rondels would need a large um, portion of the inner ar area of the rondel. The inner bank would significantly reduce the gathering uh, space of rondels. The banks of the inside of the ditch would have to be built past a possible palisade. On the contrary, building a bank along the outer edge of uh, a ditch uh, or ditches at multiple rondels allow its body to be moved somewhat from the edge of uh, this ditch. This fact reduced the erosion rate of the bank to the ditch. The larger diameter of the bank of the outside of the ditches from which the less was would be uh, not uh, so wide and height and therefore avoid the excavation of neighboring ditches. The bank discovery helped deepen uh, the study of rondel typology. There are now analogies, but about 2,000 years younger, are found in British uh, islands, Fbury, Durrington, Walls, Woodhand, Stonehenge, and others. Anthropomorphic statuettes in the ditch of the rondel near Těšetice. In this uh, uh, context, we present another important result. There is a remarkable a question of the utterly unusually occurrence of a unique finding of 134 uh, um, torsos of anthropomorphic statuettes, one applied anthropomorphic motif, four zoomorphic statuettes, uh, two zoomorphic lead handles, and one zoomorphic protuberance, uh, 142 in total, in the ditch of the simple rondel at Těšetice Kijovice z Neumo district. These are uh, exceptional artifacts associated uh, with the cult of fertility and fruitfulness. How did these significant finds get into the ditch field, assuming the presence of the bank from the outside and the palisades from the inside of the rondel? We explain this by deliberate mani manipulation with the terracotta female and zoomorphic statuettes, the idols, uh, having been ritually broken as a uh, substitute for human um, sacrifice and uh, then throw into ditch. Acoustic. It is very impor important that uh, the banks line around the rondels also improved the acoustic inside the rondels, wheeling this aspect, the every probable connection with verbal speeches, speech singing with dance and music realized by important members, members of the societies within rondels. This uh, hypothesis is in accordance with the well-founded assumption uh, that the communities organize higher level activities when they assemble it for social um, management, administration, uh, judicial activity, exchange of information, meeting of young people, rights, choose, economic exchange of goods, etc., and uh, religious events, cult of the fertility and fruitfulness, uh, or for uh, time monitoring, simple astronomical observations, calendar functions, and dialogue with universe and its order. Collective character. Our further point is that work of rondel building had a collective character. There were that time monumental artworks built exclusively in selected center settlements which uh, required excavation and uh, relocation of thousands of cubics uh, of soil, it means less. In the case of the simple rondel at Těšetice Kijovice, diameter uh, of about uh, 60 meter, it was uh, circa 1,530 cubic meters, it means 2,754 tons of less. The multiple rondel at Semei in the south of Hungary uh, consisted of uh, one inner ditch with the diameter of about uh, 100 meters, 
two middle ditches with uh, a diameter of uh, 220 meters and four to five outer ditches of 45 to uh, five, uh, four, uh, 450 uh, to 550 meters. It is assumed that approximately uh, 20,000 cubic meters were exploited, that is about circa 32,000 tons of less. Naturally, there was a need for multi labor cooperation also with regard to the level of working tools. We also assume synergy with the inhabitants of uh, nearby settlements for which Rondel could also serve. We might think about a greater integration into late Neolithic societies. Building the rondel, uh, rondels must have incorpor incorporated the absolutely necessary coordination of work. These activities include, for example, the selection of a suitable place of the, at the central settlements, the construction of the rondel itself, uh, con uh, consisting uh, of the measurements of circle at the individual ditches, the very difficult ditch excavation, the accumulation of the excavated less, the landscaping of the inner surface, including its possible leveling. For example, the northwest uh, entrance of Plotiště nad Labem to or leveling in the form of a, a significant uh, reduction of the terrain level between the ditches in multiple rondels uh, at Golianovo, southwest Slovakia. Uh, this uh, reduction are uh, 160 uh, to uh, 200 uh, centimeters. Yes? Astronomy. But observation, we discovered the astronomical uh, orientation of two, three, four to six rondel entrances. In the direction of the four cardinal points, the banks and the ditches are interrupted by entrances. Together with the calculation of uh, paleoastronomers, we measure uh, that uh, the eastern entrance to the rondel corresponds to the sunrise in the local landscape, uh, the uh, distortion against the geographic east was due to the relief of the terrain. In the time limit of the most important astronomical dates, as in the spring and autumn equinox, spring, it is very important, or during the winter and summer solstice. It is matter of uh, monitoring the running of time for the likely purpose of holding great celebrations of the Neolithic cult of um, fecundity and fruitfulness with respect to the basic agrotechnical deadlines in order to secure a mindful uh, crop and full accordance with the basic astronomical dates. Of course, the Neolithic peasants plowed the fields and uh, repeat uh, the harvest according to the uh, current weather conditions and according, uh, according uh, to their own experience. Uh, monitoring of uh, time. The basis of time tracking is the cyclicality of the season alternation in a relation to agriculture, uh, crop graving, corn graving, and uh, livestock farming. The oldest Neolithic farmers were very tightly uh, bound to nature. The old farmers have correctly observed the changes in the seasons according to the change in the length of the day and the daily temperature, as well as the changes in the bus, flora, and fauna. We believe that the, the Neolithic farmers also for the thousands of years of know-how gained by observing uh, the recurring position of the most important planets, stars, and the clearest constellations in the sky, including the moon and so-called motion of the sun. All events were justified by the uh, then belief that all events are the work of uh, supernatural powers, spirit, and the like. Everything is from heaven. 
For this reason, Neolithic farmers divided the year in seasons, um, which they asso associate with basic agricultural work, such as plowing, sowing, planting, harvesting, including celebrations, as a gratitude uh, for the crop and period of, of uh, veg uh, vegetative uh, dormancy. We consider it very probable of natural nature with regard to the psychological aspect that uh, anniversary celebrations took place in, on this uh, milestone of the annual cycle. During these holiday days, people could depart from the stereotype of everyday life. The Rondal site might have been used to celebrate the religion of the late Neolithic. We have already pointed out that our evidence of the existence of banks built around rondels intensified among the things, uh, things uh, acoustic and their uh, interior. Differences in the orientation of the rondels inputs can be explained either merely from a technical standpoint, unfinished uh, construction or um, intention of the rondel builders. Relatively frequent orientation east-west of rondels with two entrances is interpreted, uh, interpreted taking uh, into account the sunrise and su sunset, a sort of reflection of the journey of the solar disk in the sky. We can say that the astronomical orientation of the rondels is an experience of Neolithic farmers' dialogue with the universe. We found that the northwest entrance of the rondel Plotiště nad Labem too has an orientation of 305 degrees. Theoretically, the northeastern entrance seems to be around 35 degrees, the southeast entrance circa 125, um, and the southwestern entrance uh, 215 degrees. In the case of the northwestern entrance to the triple rondel potiště nad Labem 2, its direction faces the sunset of the summer solstice. Entrances oriented to the northeastern and northwest could answer the questions with a certain degree of probability whether the sunrise and sunset of the summer solstice and the entrance to the southeast and southwest correspond with the direction of the sunrise and sunset of the winter solstice, which were influenced uh, by the Eagle Mountains uh, or Litske Hori on the eastern horizon. Most of the rondels have uh, four entrances directed in accordance with important astronomical dates in the calendar year, most probably in uh, compliance with the uh, sunrise on the date of the vernal equinox. Some rondels, however, could uh, also be directed sunrise on solstice. The orientation entrances into rondels but may be modified based on the relief of the local landscape. This is particularly true of uh, the ridges of hills and uh, mountains on the eastern horizon of the rondel, which could delay sunrise uh, of the equinox or the time of the solstice towards south. Other entrances dissented due to this reason. We don't exclude that the other rondels could also have directed their entrances to the moon and to significantly uh, sign, mm, uh, shining stars or uh, constellation. All these facts are based on the limit position of the globe in air orbit around the sun. The Neolithic farmers certainly watch the four seasons and associate hinges in changes in nature. Central, central settlements. The 
results uh, of the previous uh, research, including our archaeological excavation and theoretical research, uh, point to similar characteristic in the strategy of Rondel location throughout their territory. Our findings were also confirmed by means to aerial archaeology and geophysical measurements. The Rondel were built as important district of social and cultural significance in the center settlements with uh, numerous settlements in their neighborhood in spring areas and on terraces of stream and rivers. We assume that people from the surrounding settlement also participate in the construction works. Rondel ditches were excavated in the layers of the less bath in Moravia and in, Morav in Bohemia. However, there are exceptions in the case of MOG1A phase rondels near the periphery of uh, the villages Biharovice and Křepice. Znojmo district. The top layers, number two, depth uh, 40 centimeters of the single rondel at Biharovice and the double rondel at Křepice were excavated partly in the less 40 centimeter and partially in the rock Leukokrak Migmatite, 40 centimeters to uh, 120 centimeters. Uh, despite the particularly hard work with, uh, which uh, was required to quarry rock from ditches and palisade trenches, it was uh, carried out. Pointed base of the triple rondel of the SBK 4A subface, Plotiště nad Labem 2, sank into the gravel sand. The tertiary Albert River terraces again because the layer of less was only 140 centimeters thick here. Culture unity. Analyzing the occurrence of rondels as objects uh, with almost identical construction element in the territory from Romania to west of Germany in various archaeological cultures, we can conclude that this fact illustrate a higher level of cultural and ideological unity in Central Europe. In the early period of the late Neolithic, we assume that rondels played the same or very similar role in the all of these cultures. Activities with the construction of this monumental rondel architecture at the central settlements of the late Neolithic have made a uh, significant uh, contribution to creating the old cultural landscape. Thank you very much for your attention. Moravia was uh, completely excavated only one rondel, uh, uh, Therefore, uh, we know that here in uh, this rondel uh, we found uh, more than um, 142 uh, parts of
these contemporary, the grapes with their elders, oh. we are from the same period, but uh, is there also architecture within this uh, around us? Do you have architecture and uh, grapes? Uh, we, we have uh, architecture, it, it means houses, for yes, example. Houses.
using? What else did they use? Uh, fruits? Did they offer something uh, in uh, pottery? Uh, cereals or fruits? Yeah. They are 